All right, guys, what's going on? It's Reefly. You guys are watching Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. See, I did it right. See, that's what, that's what I meant to do in the first part or something like that. Whatever. And last time we, uh, we learned of Edward Kenway, the ancestor of Haytham and Connor. Kenway. And, uh, he was a pirate. He washed up ashore. Assassin washed up ashore as well. Uh, he killed an assassin, which probably isn't good news. And now he's acting as the assassin, Duncan Wapple, and we're at Havana. And we're gonna help uh, Steve Bonnet here. Have a man of your stature nearby. Misunderstanding. I can hang about. I might have a drink. Spend it. <laughs> drink. <laughs> But they don't take kindly to pirates here, do they? Wonder how many stolen reals bought these men this perch. What are you looking at, man? Get a hammer and break that. You don't know these women, do you? No. Hello, ladies. They charge money for that kind of privilege. A few dozen reals for every hour of knowing. Keen to meet them? No, goodness no, I'm a, I'm a married man. Married man of their four day mate. God, this game does look good, man. That composite cable thing sucked compared to this. Like, this isn't even on PS4 either. I should probably. Aha! Here's a purveyor of personal. Actually, really persuaded to upgrade. I should require a blade for myself, Duncan, just as you have. This rusty razor's nothing to admire. Even so, I appear a mere kitten walking so close upon you. Perhaps a small dagger would suit me. Let's see what he's selling. Maybe I'll buy a sword too. We'll both jump rank. Oh, we'll be quite the pair, you and I. Twin devils. <laughs> Lend us a few reals, then. I did save your skin. Ah, uh, of course. Cheers. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, sure, I guess. All right, let's upgrade me swords. That's a better fit for me. How do you fare? I had only enough for a small knife, sadly. Still. It'll do in a pinch. Oh, huff a duff. I have led us astray, Duncan. Oh, no matter. I'll get us a better view. What are we looking for? Every finger's a fish hook. That's how you tell a true sailor. <laughs> uh, okay. Climb. I am noticing that it doesn't look as good on the screen. I did lower the bit rate just because I don't really want as big of file sizes as I have been getting. I mean, it still looks decent. Uh, I'll probably up it for you guys just so it looks nicer. I'll probably set it back to what I usually have for PS4 games. I have it at nine, which I think I see the place. We're not far. Hang tight. I assassinate from here. No. I can't breathe. Stop or I'll break your knees. Okay, that's right. I usually have it at ten and or eleven. That was quick. <laughs> I looted him. What is this crap? I'm close at heel, shitbird. You robbed the wrong man, mate. Fourteen. That's all he stole. Wow. He's a terrible thief. Yeah, but right now it's at night. I like. I know. uh... Hello Japan. I, I I may be wrong with this. So if if he's watching this, correct me or not. Of course I am. That felt was no fuss. Oh yeah. I know Hello Japan said he only does it at like like seven or something like that. Seven at a seven bit rate. Maybe even lower. I don't know. Take your time, I'll be just here. 
I, I think I'm higher than most people. Well, deep in Dago country. I'm English myself. Biding my time till the next war calls me to service. Lucky King George. I'm gonna piss pot like you flying his flag. Oi! Skulk! I've seen your face before. Use mates with them pirates down in Nassau. Shut your fucking gob or I'll fill it with shots, you hear me? <laughs> Edward, is it? Edward, you gotta pull it. All right, it's on. You want to dust up? I'll All right, basic one. combat tutorials. Snap his neck, which is a little bit uncalled for. Come on, lads. I've seen bigger arms on a bird. Oh, I got to throw him. Okay. So the combat is a little bit different. Then, uh, then, uh, Assassin's Creed 3, but it keeps the basics going. One more. Come on. Oh, you hit me. Oh, you man. Oh, you mate. Quit it. Boom, you're dead. Smoke bomb. Hey, do, do, do. hey mate, see you later. You tackle me, eh? Climb. You can't shoot me, I'm a gingerbread man. All right, let's find a hiding place. Nope, I guess I didn't need to. 100% sink, 100% playthrough. No, don't, don't count on it, don't. Count on it. All right, let's head to the next place. Do 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 do. Keep on running, running. Don't want to go down there yet. And of my sugar. Sorry about the swift exit. Bit of a misunderstanding. One heap to put another. Oh, Jesus. I'm sorry, mate. This is my doing. I'm only trying to keep these Spanish eyes off me. Oh, it's no bother. Regrettably, the soldiers confiscated my sugar for when your dispatches. Damn! And where have they gone? Haven't the foggiest idea, I'm afraid. I suspect those chaps might, but my Spanish is wee mal dad, so I, I'd rather not ask. Shit! All right, come on, let's follow them and recover my maps. And my sugar? What, in my drawers? We'll see what happens. Yeah, I just I just turned on Eagle Vision. You don't have to tell me. I know. I know. I don't really like the Eagle Vision in this game. It's too Not if you keep quiet, easy to know where everybody is. Bullet. I believe I'm getting the hang of this. Quiet. I fear they're onto us. Hang back. Perhaps we should split up to confuse them. It's the best idea you had today. Great idea, Bonnet. Uh, 
All right, let's keep chilling. Yes, senor, is you're late. Yes, sir. See, uh, we are very sorry. Our captain delayed us. Yeah, I don't have Xbox Live at the moment, and I'm not sure if I'm gonna get it again just because this is not my main console anymore. 360. But uh, so if any, uh, I guess I still update it, but. I don't know why I even mentioned that. Yeah, I just thought I'd mention it. Oh, come on, what? Buddy, buddy, we need to talk. It's called You Shut Up. Get the swords out. What is this, playtime? No, we're gonna fight to the death. Uh, I don't really see anybody. Hey, do detente. Ow, buddy, that hurt. You're dead. Okay, we're heading over here. I'm gonna be very stealthy. <laughs> Where are you guys going? I just want to have some. I just want to talk to you. Wow, they're booking it. They are booking it. Guys, you guys need to relax. There's nothing to worry about. Nobody is following you. That is a guarantee. This way. This way. Who moves around like this? Just jumps around? Me, that's who. I don't know why we're running. Maybe because they already noticed me. Whatever. We'll just hide behind the hay. I need to... Ease drop. Hanging tape, man. Tell me to hang about all day for the captain. We can say anything, sir. Captain Mendoza needs only to hang the man, then he will deliver your payment. I don't want real in mind. I want goods, things I can sell, tobacco, rum, sugar. See, <laughs> see, si, si. we have much fine sugar. Great, we took off a fat Englishman last night. Very fine. We hold it in the Castillo after the man started the fight last night. He ran, left his sugar behind. Very fine. Well, that's a start. Shall I accompany him to the Castillo? <laughs> no, sir. Captain Mendoza will have it sent to you, I believe. You will see. Good lord. Is that big brute your Captain Mendoza? No, sir. He is El Tiburon. El Tiburon, Governor Torres' man. Excuse me, people. <laughs> I just need to, uh... Walk over here, we're gonna do a little fast walk.
If you see some a group of people walking in like this kind of formation, you gotta think, yeah, something's going on here. Steal the captain's key. All right. Mind if I rob you either? else in here? There's this. Sneak to the fort lockup. Oh, come on, buddy. Yeah, I'm just gonna kill you. Oh, we grabbed it. Got skills to pay the bills. If anybody's a fan of mine, they know that I... Well, they know Assassin's Creed is my favorite series. It's pretty close to... Uh, Zelda's pretty close and Fallout's pretty close, but... Assassin's Creed is my favorite. And they know that I'm pretty... Pretty decent at these games. I'm pretty good. At least I think so. <laughs> hey, para. Nope, don't do that. Nope, I suck. I'm hoping he would do a double kill, but. Sometimes you don't want to do that. Ugh! Dodge! I forgot how to handle these guys. Ha! <laughs> I threw you into there, punk! Oh, he's not even dead either. Okay, I ran away. He should be dead too. I don't know how I died. I call bullcrap. Of course, when I mention I'm pretty good at these games, I die. That's the way it goes, I guess. That's the way the cookie crumbles. Do I have hidden blades? I probably didn't even equip them. Hey buddy, I'm right here. Yeah, get suspicious. Crap, I thought that was a God dang, I thought that was leaves. Or hay. Okay. <laughs> I'm still selfie. Stealthiest person here. They call me Mr. Sneaky Pants. You don't want to know why I got that name, okay? I am doing really bad. 
Through it! No more sneaking! Boom, you're dead. You're all dead. Open that up. I mean, we'll see by it. We, we definitely didn't, didn't get his sugar. That is for sure. I, mean, I definitely did not get 100% of that mission. No, don't dive back in. No! <laughs> Quit it! We know you like diving, but sometimes you gotta resist the urge. Whoa! whoa. Disappeared. I think somebody should investigate that fisherman. I'm just saying. cargo here to make a profit on my trip. Will you stay here long? For a few weeks, yes. Then back to Barbados, to the tedium of domesticity. Don't settle for tedium. Sail for Nassau. Live life as you see fit. <laughs> Haven't I heard that Nassau is crawling with pirates? Seems a very tawdry place. Not tawdry, liberated. Oh, God. That would be an adventure. But no, no, I'm a husband and a father. I have responsibilities. Life can't be all pleasure and distraction, Duncan. Hey, our bonnet. The name's Edward, in truth. Duncan's only a handle. Ah. Secret name for your secret meeting with the governor. The governor, right. I think I've kept him waiting long enough. Yeah, hundred percent. I stayed out of combat. I just definitely fought people in front of their faces when they were aware of me. I still consider that stealth. All right, let's head over here. Let's run, 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 Rudolph. I can save that because it's less than a week away from Christmas. I can save it. It's the holiday season. I can say holiday jokes. Do, 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 do. I'm not going to do really much at all as far as side stuff. This is mainly a main story. Let's play. Because the game is already pretty long. And I, I just, I don't like the long Let's Plays, to be honest. Even though most of the games I like are fairly long. And also, uh, I think that was the last part where we were talking about Assassin's Creed Liberation. Uh, Liberation HD is coming out in January, so a few weeks. I will probably do that since I have not played that game either. Um, yeah, so I might have two Assassin's Creed games going on at once. Which, I don't know how I feel about that. I might get burnt out. We'll see. 24 minutes, I, I think I can keep going. Actually, 25. I'm, I'm sorry, 25 minutes. 
Mr. Duncan Walpole of England to see the governor. I believe he is expecting me. Sí, señor Walpole. Entre, por favor. Can I come in? Uh, can I come in? No running, I guess. Ese es el hombre. El ¿Cómo lo llamabas? Asesino. Sí, Duncan Walpole. Debería haber llegado hace muchos días. No me gusta. Sir, would I be correct in thinking you are Dr. Walpole? I am indeed. I thought as much. Woods Rogers, a pleasure. The same. I must say, my wife has a terrible eye for description. I'm sorry? My wife. You met her some years ago at the Percy's Masquerade Ball. Ah, quite. She called you devilishly handsome. Obviously a lie to stoke my jealousy. Oh, <laughs> funny. Julian, our guest of honor has arrived, Mr. Duncan Walpole. <sighs> Julian Ducasse. <laughs> I hope your conversion to our order is an honest one. I have no love for assassins, but even less for liars. I have not come to disappoint. <laughs> Up for a bit of sport, Duncan? The old man isn't ready just yet. Oh man, we're hanging with Templars. I've got my two best pairs of matched pistols, Duncan. So handle them with care. If I had eight, I'd treat each as my own son. Pull off a few shots if you like. Get a feel for it. <laughs> I once fought beside a man who carried nine on his person. They were a boot in battle, but hindered his ability to swing. Sadly. <laughs> Quite. A good kick, yes? I long for the day where one firearm carries four bullets and not the other. I have a friend in England you may like to meet. James Puckle. He's working on something extraordinary. Magnifique. All right, I did it. Or try to strike every target before this hour empties. Remember, hit every target within the allotted time. No, question is next. Ah, dang it. Well, we're going to fail this time. Luck, eh? All right. Here's a simple challenge. Try to strike every target before this hourglass empties. Remember, hit every target within the allotted time. Oh, hit him! Wrong guy! You just shot me in the face, dude! Oh my god, I'm terrible. Challenge. Try to strike every target before this hourglass empties. Remember, hit every target within the allotted time. I have to reload. Dang it! Can you keep reloading, please? Bad 
Duncan. Where are your wrist blades? I've never seen an assassin so ill-equipped. Ah. Damaged, sadly, beyond all repair. Uh-huh. Have your choice. Where did you find all these? <laughs> I did not find them. I took them. These are souvenirs. Two blades. That is the custom, eh? Custom, aye. Duncan, will you indulge us with a demonstration of your techniques? Well, uh... We must. We put together a training course in anticipation of your arrival. It would be a shame to leave here without seeing you in action. Yes, of course. Well, I mean, if there is time, I would gladly, uh, Show you what I know. Here. Yeah. You see? Situation as well as suited to your skills. Have a go! A blade in a crowd is always the simplest. Nothing grandiose, just quick and clean. Alright, I am very upset with this. I'm very upset with the way they did this. Like, he automatically knows the skills of a assassin. No, he doesn't. No, it's it's ridiculous. God, that's the spirit. Like I know we're trying to speed it up, but seriously, it kind of it really annoys me. I think you guys should probably know these tricks. Is it also possible to deliver a killing blow at high speed? Mon dieu, such a powerful strike. Fascinating. Oh, we're done. Okay. <laughs> I thought we had more to do. The assassins have trained you well, Don. You chose a perfect time to leave them behind. At great risk, I imagine. Betraying the assassins is never good for one's health. Well, neither is drinking liquor, but I am drawn to its dangers all the same. And what is your business here, sir? Are you an associate of the governor's, or a pending acquaintance like myself? Guns, blades, cannons, grenados, anything that may kill a man, I am happy to provide. A smuggler of sorts. And how is your wife these days, Captain Rogers? Is she... Uh, Shut up, phone! ...in Havana? I trust she's well, but I wouldn't know. I've been in Madagascar some 14 months hunting pirates. It took some work to dislodge the criminals there, but we managed it. In future, okay. I hope to use these same tactics throughout the West Indies. And how did you deal with that kind? Very simply. Most pirates are as ignorant as apes. I merely offered them a choice. Take a pardon and return to England penniless, but free men. Or be hanged by the neck until dead. Oh. I imagine NASA would be your next target. Very astute, Duncan, indeed. Best of luck with that. Grandmaster Torres! Mr. Duncan Walpole has arrived. See. Si. We expected one week ago. Apologies, Governor. My ship was set upon by pirates. We were scuttled. I arrived only yesterday. Unfortunate. Forgive my caution, but were you able to salvage from these pirates the items you promised me? Uh, yes, sir. I was. Incredible. The assassins have more resources than I had imagined, but not nearly enough to 
to deter us. It is a pleasure to meet you at last, Duncan. You are most welcome. Come, gentlemen. We have much to discuss. Convened at last, and in such continental company. England, France, Spain, citizens of sad and corrupted empires. But you are Templars now, the secret and true legislatures of the world. Please, hold out your hands. Mark and remember our purpose. To guide our wayward souls till they've reached a quiet road. To guide all wayward desire till impassioned hearts are cool. To guide all wayward minds to safe and sober thought. By the Father of Understanding's light, let our work now begin. Decades ago, the Council entrusted me with the task of locating in these West Indies a forgotten place our precursors once called the Observatory. See here. Look up on these images and commit them to memory. They tell a very old and important story. For two decades now, I have endeavored to locate this observatory. A place rumored to contain a tool of incredible utility and power. It houses a kind of armillary sphere, if you like. A device that will grant us the power to locate and monitor every man and woman on Earth, whatever their location. Only imagine what it would mean to have such a power. With this device, there will be no secrets among men. No lies, no trickery. Justice, pure justice. This is the observatory's promise, and we must take it for our own. Do we know its whereabouts? We will soon, for in our custody is the one man who does, a man named Roberts, once called a sage. It has been 45 years since anyone has seen a true sage. Can you be sure this one is authentic? We are confident he is. The assassins will come for him. Indeed they will, but thanks to Duncan and the information he has delivered, the assassins won't be a problem for much longer. All will be made clear tomorrow, gentlemen, when you meet the sage for yourselves. Until then, let us drink. Let us find the observatory together, for with its power, kings will fall. Clergy will cower, and the hearts and minds of the world will be ours. I didn't mean to skip the shooting. <laughs> I just talked to every guy to see what would happen, and it skipped it. Rest well, Duncan. Tomorrow the treasure fleet arrives, and with it, your reward. After which we will discuss further schemes. I look forward to it. Excelente. Meet me down at the docks first thing tomorrow morning. Governor Torres requests your presence at the docks near the Castillo. First thing tomorrow morning. Alright, so I will end it there. So next part, we are going to uh, meet up with Governor Torres and uh, keep doing stuff. But uh, I'm Reef. If you guys are watching this, Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. Well, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next part.